everyone, my name is Fatima Calixti and I just wanted to share a testimony with you guys. Um, basically when Pastor Gary today um, did the message of the power of Peace Square, I just felt like God was speaking to me and that I needed to share with you guys my testimony. And basically what happened to me is I was on vacation about last week and um, that Sunday night my manager called me and she basically told me not to report to work that Monday morning which I was scheduled to. She said go straight to HR which is in another building and you know I was I was um, baffled and confused. I didn't understand why. I mean I know we've had our history where she basically um, doesn't want me there. Um, she's flat out told me that she wants another pharmacist there so I, I, I know there's you know she doesn't want me there so um, basically that Monday I went to, to HR and they basically told me that these allegations were brought towards me um, by my manager and they basically wanted me to stay home while they investigate to see if there's any truth to, to what she said um, as regarding my performance at work. Um, so I basically left there you know with my head down confused and wondering you know why is this happening to me you know why, why me God I was thinking. Um, and then as I'm driving home, I call my friend who used to work there with me. Um, she's a Christian as well, and I just basically told her what had just happened to me. And she just basically started praying on the phone with me. And she told me, you know, you, you have to take this time and just basically praise God. Um, just keep praying, you know, you have to thank Him at all times. And I just basically took her advice and that whole week while I was home. I didn't share anything with anybody, just basically my husband, what had happened. And I just stayed home. I would go in my closet just praying Him and praising Him over night and day. I just kept at it, reading my Bible, praising Him, praying and praising and praying and praising. And then um, that following Tuesday, a week later, a week and one day, um, HR basically called me to come back to the building and they basically apologized and said, you know, we're sorry, none of these allegations were true when we did our investigation and we want you to come back to work. You're an asset to the company and we want you to come back to work and you will get paid for that week that you were out. So I just wanted to, to share with you guys that if God did this for little old me, I know he can do it for you guys. I'm not some, you know, powerful preacher or, you know, I'm just little Fatima. So I know if he can do this for me by me believing in him, you know, he did it for me. I know he can do it for you guys. All you have to do is stay through it. Just praise him in your time of need. And, you, you know, when, when the storm comes, praise him, not just when things are going good as it was for me. I had, you know, my friend who encouraged me, thank God for her, and I just continued to praise him and pray and praise him and pray, and then, you know, God came through for me, and and I just felt just so emotional doing that service when Pastor Gary did it because I felt like God was speaking to me, and I just wanted to share with you guys that keep praying and pray to him at all times, give thanks to God, and I know he can do miracles for you as well. Thank you.